hi so this is the project overview for the project uh, land registration on blockchain technology to test the core functionality and the like basic design of the of this project before like, we move on to further uh, steps in the refinement process so what we can see over here is like uh, we have this nav bar we can we have uh, certain options like uh, for managing land i have created uh, for new for registering new land tokens we can um, go over here for verifying an existing land ownership uh, we can check who is the owner of a particular land uh, for uh, like i uh, we can uh, see all the lists of the lands which the particular owner uh, like possesses over here and uh, we can explore the available lands which are uh, for sale and uh, for approving the transfer of the land like someone created to uh, to change the ownership of the land if it is in your uh, like if it is in your position you can approve the transfer uh, from over here so basically what we'll do is uh, we'll first create, uh, we'll first uh, log in with the user one you can see over here it, uh, we have created two default users so user one is logged in right now so we'll register a land uh, let's say uh, 32 plot number area is where we are district will put it Malane, Jaipur, Rajasthan and we will put it as 200 square yards so we will register the land and approve the transaction and we can see over here the land is registered successfully you can see uh, the land over here like this uh, will show you the lands which uh, is in possession of the user one so the land uh, id is given as one and you can see that the owner is uh, 0x9fa which is the same address for the 0x9fa user one okay so we'll uh, so we'll uh, try to ch uh, change the ownership of this land the land id1 uh, to the user2 so we'll first put it for sale uh, like uh, user1 will have to put it for sale uh, after putting it for sale it will ask for a confirmation and you can see over here that land id1 ma is marked for sale so in the explore land section we will see the land uh, id1 so we'll log in with the user too so we'll log in with the, we have logged in with the user too you can see that the user too currently has no no land owned by this account when we explore the land we can see that land id1 is available for sale uh, and uh, if the user 2 wants to like change the ownership of the uh, land to uh, to his name uh, he can request a transfer from over here you can see request transfer we'll approve that transfer request so the transfer request is submitted for land id1 and uh, we can uh, now log in uh, from user one again and look for approval transfer so there it is uh, so user requester and this uh, this is the uh, address of the requester which is the address of the user two in this case you can see 0x8 and the owner is uh, us user one use ux 0x 9fa so we can approve or deny the uh, transfer request 
So, uh, so here we'll approve the request and confirm. So transfer approved for land ID one. So basically, uh, now if so we are logged in from user one. So if we see uh, the available lands uh, in possession of user one, so there are no lands uh, owned by this account. Also, uh, there are no lands for sale. But when we log in from the user two, you can see that uh, show lands. So here it is. So the user two you can confirm from here. So the user two uh, will have the position for the land ID one. So, uh, and for like checking the uh, for checking the blockchain the uh, all the lands registered uh, at one place you can uh, check with the admin panel. So we'll have to log in with the uh, with an account with administrator privileges. So in this case, I've given the user one with administrator privileges. Uh, like it doesn't need to be uh, either of the user. It uh, it can be another account which we can add. Uh, like for example, we'll first log in with user one. Now uh, we see the uh, options available up in the admin panel, which are the show lands and past ownership details. So basically, show lands will uh, show us all the lands which are uh, like uh, registered uh, in the blockchain, and uh, the past ownership details will uh, ask for a particular land ID. And if we uh, like, we can see the uh, all the ownership details which uh, the land had in the past uh, in the chronological order i think uh, this is the project overview for now uh, i'll uh, keep on updating the project and fixing the like minute errors there are, it is not uh, the final prototype so i'll keep updating it and uh, yeah Thank you.